Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Okay, I have my final review for Paul and Chris Woodham's All Burn Chili. Some amazing products uh, that they sent me all the way over from Perth, Western Australia. Make sure you check out my first review that I did on their Mango Meltdown. Get a little bit more information about the company. I also reviewed their Pineapple for Pussies, their Tomato Tingle, and all of their products that I've tasted so far are just absolutely fantastic. Now, I've saved the uh, the hottest one for last. I guess I've been putting this one off for a little while because I know how hot it's going to be. But this is All Burn Chili's award-winning Blazing Plum. Check that out. Awesome looking new labels on here. This is uh, Paul and Chris Woodham's All Burn Chili blazing plum hot sauce now notice what that heat meter says there if you can see it 13 out of 10 is it going to be that hot well let's check it out and find out it says concocted in the druids pot of all burned chilies chief saucier paul woodhams this mixture contains combines the awesome heat of bogan loads a bogan load Bogan loads of the Maruga Scorpion Chili, a renowned super hot. Now, I just love how Paul uses Maruga Scorpions on all of his hot sauces. I think that's the only pepper, at least the sauces that I've tried, the only pepper that he uses. He knows how to give you the flavor and, and heat of a Maruga Scorpion in a toned down way, uh, like the Tomato Tingle, which is a 3 out of 10 for heat. Um, and he knows how to uh, make it with a... Uh, bogan loads like he says here to make it really really hot so i really love that about it the maruga scorpion is an excellent pepper it can it can give you all the heat you need really um but i love the way paul does it in his uh, milder sauces as well it says he combines that chili with the fresh subtle flavors of plums lime and honey to produce a sauce which provides a great initial kick followed by a fresh pleasant lingering taste Use it to increase both the heat and flavor levels of your favorite dish. Goes great straight up on a steak. All right, you'll find out about that in a minute. Uh, Rizzoli's sausages and burgers. Handle with care. All right, ready to feel the all burn. Now, here's the ingredients on this one, guys. First ingredient, Maruga Scorpion chilies, plums, lime juice, fish sauce. Giving it some umami. And a garlic, ginger apple cider vinegar, honey, and spices, gluten-free. All right, now just check out that beautiful dark plum color on this one, guys. Um, nice consistency, nice and thick, but uh, smooth and pourable thick. Not so thick that you got to, you know, shake it out in globs. This one's going to th pour thick and nice and easy, but it, it's not thin. It's just really, really nice and thick, but... A creamy thick, pourable thick is what I'm trying to say. All right, let's check this one out. Whew, okay. Now, you can immediately smell, in every one of his hot sauces, you can really pick up the fire, the flavor, and the heat of that uh, Maruga Scorpion. But this one's definitely more pronounced, but you can actually smell the tart, sweet plums that kind of follow. I always pick up on the honey in Paul's hot sauces, which is great. Just a nice level of sweetness combined with that lime and the plums. Now it doesn't smell fishy, so I don't smell the fish sauce, but I know that that's, <coughs> excuse me, creating kind of a, a really nice umami, um, savory, delicious flavor combined with all these ingredients. Okay, here we go. Let's try this out on a spoon. Blazing plum. Now just look at this beautiful stuff. All right, nice big old spoonful. You think that's enough? Okay, here we go. Blazing plum. Mm. Oh wow! When you do that much at once, woo! You get the flavor. <clears throat> <coughs> this is hot. Oh, immediate fire and. And burn of the Maruga scorpion peppers is kind of getting the tip of the tongue just a little bit for some reason. Then it's getting kind of the throat where I swallowed it down. Starting to tear up already a little bit. Yeah, this one's got some heat, but a real nice immediate sweetness, tartness coming from the plums. Woo! 
I haven't had one quite this hot in a while, guys. Man, I'm, glasses will probably start fogging up. A beautiful flavor. Not too sweet. Woo. Man, this stuff is delicious. Really, really good. Mm. Wow, this is burning all the way down here. Yeah, this is as you talk, it just flames up the heat on the mouth. Yeah, this is a chili head sauce right here, guys. Uh, but yeah, beautiful flavor from the Maruga scorpions combined with the plum. A little bit of um, tart lime. Really savory flavor coming, you know, from the, um, I can't read, <laughs> the garlic and the uh, ginger that's in here. And the uh, fish sauce is just giving it a really nice flavor. Sweeten just a little bit with the honey. Oh, wow. That one took my breath away. Yeah, really strong, super hot burn on the mouth. Okay, before I can't talk anymore, let me go ahead and show you a picture of what I did with this. I put this on a New York strip steak. It was delicious. Had some uh, grilled zucchini along with that. Just absolutely fantastic on steak. I bet it'd be also good on burgers and, you know, grilled meats and things like that. Just fantastic. Wow. Yeah, this one's pretty hot, Paul. Um, I don't know if I'd go with 13 out of 10, but um, I think I'm going to give this one a, I think it's a solid 9 out of 10 on heat, my 1 to 10 scale. It's at that level. Yeah, really a real hot, super hot um, sauce and burn all over the mouth. Gets the back of the throat a little bit. Gets you down here. Makes you tear up. Got kind of that fuminess from uh, the heat of the peppers, but just a beautiful flavor on this one. Absolutely fantastic. Don't recommend doing that once at, that much at once. And uh, just pour a little bit on your food, and as you eat your food, it's going to be blistering hot, but it's so delicious. Woo! Wow. This one's really got me crying. Kind of brings back my days of reviewing fresh um, peppers. Whoa, okay. Whoa, coming down a little bit now. Yeah, 9 out of 10. Solid 9 out of 10 for heat. Flavor is just outstanding as well. Highly recommend it. If you want a, a true chili head sauce with an awesome burn, awesome flavor. Flavor is important as well, guys. Uh, this is really well done, Paul and Chris. Thank you so much for sending it. I do appreciate it. Guys, give me a like on Facebook. I'll put the website in the description, auburnchilies.com. Make sure you check it out. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more. And until the next time, enjoy the burn. Whew, we'll see you guys later.